In our local interest segment this week, we felt it was important to mention that we are re-entering hurricane season here in Florida. We've been fairly lucky over the last decade here in Florida, particularly in the Gulf Coast region, but we never know when we could be facing a big storm with only a few days warning which is why you need to go ahead and stock up on some water and relatively non-perishable foods like dried beans and peanut butter. Remember that once the alert goes out on the news, the grocery stores will sell out almost immediately. Because of just-in-time delivery, the stores actually don't have supplies in the back warehouse like they used to. Instead, they basically have what is on the shelves, and once that's gone, they're sold out. So that means there simply is not enough food and water for you to plan to go to the store after you know that there is a hurricane coming. And some of you may be wondering where this public service announcement is coming from, and I'll tell you. Just last week in Missouri, an F3, F4 tornado struck and killed several people and destroyed an entire community. While I was thinking about it, I thought how lucky we are in the state of Florida to get a few days' notice of a major storm. Folks living in Tornado Alley only get a few minutes. Given what we've seen over the past decade in Tornado Alley, I have to think that a bunch of those folks might be thinking about moving to Florida, where at least you get a little bit of warning before the big storm hits. I tell you, everybody's moving to Florida nowadays. Why? Because we're a great low-tax state with the government staying out of the economy enough to let businesses actually thrive. So we've got economically quite a bit going on, whereas some of the other states like California don't have as much because, well, they've got a lot of cooks in the kitchen. And everybody up in Sacramento's got their fingers in the pie and trying to run business like the Chinese do out of a centralized committee. And folks, that never, never works. Thank you for listening to The Morgan Streetman Show. We hope you enjoyed what you heard, and if you did, please click like and subscribe to help us out. And remember that we recommend that you exercise your brain at least once a week.